This week, I built a fun DIY basket. Out of? Paint sticks. <laughs> That's right, so put on your tools, guys. It's time for Mega Break. Welcome back to Mega Break, guys. I'm Rob. And I'm Sarah. And this week, I built a fun, really simple DIY project out of paint sticks and the new stapler. Right, which is maybe your favorite tool, and we never use it. I know, we need to more often. So it was a good time, here's how it went. <laughs> so today I'm making a basket out of all of those paint sticks. Besides the sticks, I also have a few square dowels, which turned out to be a bit small, but you'll see why in a minute. I first had to measure them so I could cut these tiny sticks to length. Fortunately, I had this huge miter saw to really get the job done. I probably could have just snapped them in half with my hand, but then I want to get to use my miter saw, so forget that. With the dowels cut, I started test fitting the paint sticks to figure out exactly how many I needed. Then I took them over to the miter saw as well and cut them down to size, which left me with a bunch of scrap, perfect for tossing on the floor. Now that I had all my pieces ready, I decided to stain them first because getting the stain between them after assembly would have been way too difficult. For my basket, I chose a pretty gray stain. It immediately made these look aged, which is super cool. I couldn't wait to see what they would look like when they were all put together. Oh, and I stained the square dowels too. When it was all dried, it was time to assemble. I essentially used the square dowels as my braces and used my stapler to staple the paint sticks to it. It sounds easy, but it wasn't. I think I should have used a larger dowel to make this easier and make the basket a little less delicate. It took a long time to get them all secured. I made one panel at a time until I had both sides. Then I started stapling more pieces between the two until it all just kind of came together. This did not go smoothly. There was a lot of struggling, so much so that we kind of forgot to shoot me stapling on the bottom, uh, but I did. You can tell because here's the finished project. Look how cute! I gave it to Jen and she found the perfect spot for it in her office. Now if you're gonna make one, I can't reiterate this enough. Use at least half inch, if not three quarters inch square dowels. It will be so much easier and look just as good. You're welcome. Well, that turned out super cute. Right? It's adorable. It was really easy. And I got to play with the stapler, which might be my almost new favorite tool. The over the circuit or something like that? I, I said almost. All right. I want to thank Hart for sponsoring this episode and reminding us we can build anything we can imagine if we do it with Hart. All right, guys. Break's over. Go make something. Mm -hmm.